This is another edition of Tanks Cooks, and this one was requested special by a fan. Rick Boss sent me an email wanting me to cook something with Taylor Ham. Yes, Taylor Ham. Not pork roll. Taylor Ham. See, it's, it says pork roll on here, but it says Taylor. Taylor Ham. Taylor Ham. You see, people in South Jersey and Philadelphia, they think it's pork roll. Pork roll? What the fuck is a pork roll? No, this is Taylor ham. And what we're having is a Jersey cheeseburger. Yes, I'm actually going to use cheese today. And we're going to be making a Jersey cheeseburger, which is Taylor ham on a hamburger. So what we can do is we got the foreman out. We got the foreman grill out. So I'm gonna put on a, a couple pieces of Taylor ham. Let me get my trusty scissors. Cut the package. Da, da, dee, 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 dee. See, here's the foreman grill. The foreman grill. We'll actually cook the ham, the Taylor ham first, put it to the side. Uh, we'll hopefully get that nice. Now, I've never actually tried to cook Taylor ham on the Foreman Grill, so I don't know how it really is going to cook up. But I'll get that ready and start it. And I'll put one piece. Two piece. Three piece. Four. So I'll have four pieces of Taylor ham cooking up, and it's Taylor ham, you know, people from South Jersey are wrong, 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 if you call it pork roll, you're wrong. So let's close this up, and let it fry up, we'll let it fry up for about a minute or so, and we'll pause while we do that. Okay, we've had this cooking for a couple of minutes. Let's grab a fork and let's flip the Taylor ham over, see how it's cooking. You know what you might need to do is you might need to get a knife here so we can get that, uh, so it cooks flat and get that Pac-Man cut. Pac-Man cut, Pac-Man cut. Do the Pac-Man cut of it. Ooh, that kind of ripped. See, I'm using a butter knife. I probably should use a sharper knife. Cut. Cut it like Pac-Man. That's when you know it's real little Taylor hand. Because it looks like Pac-Man. See, don't that doesn't that look like Pac-Man? It looks like Pac-Man. Well, let's pause it again. Okay, let's see how our Taylor ham is cooking. It doesn't take too long to cook Taylor ham. Yes, it's thin. But we'll flip it over. It's looking real good. Looking like it's almost done. Put it off for maybe another minute. In the meantime, we'll knock off the XX ice on this uh, frozen hamburger. I mean, it's been in the freezer for a while. And we'll get that ready to go. Boom. You know, it's only Thanksgiving is getting upon us. I'll have my nice turkey hat. Gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble. Do, 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 do. Da, da, da. Yep, the Taylor hand is done. Now we'll put on the hamburger. Da, 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 
And of course, you know what's going on in Hamburger. Down, down, bound, down, 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 down. And a little bit of salt. And a little bit of pepper. Brush the accent all around it. Lower the top. And listen to that thing fry. We'll check in in it on in exactly three minutes. Alexa, set a timer for three minutes. Three minutes. Starting now. Anticipation. Anticipation is making me crazy. All right, how much? So as I'm waiting here for the three minutes, waiting for Alexa to ring her bell, and we'll see how the hamburger is doing. Hopefully it's doing quite well. And there she is. Alexa, stop! All right, now we'll flip the burger. We'll smoosh down the burger a little bit. Get the juices starting to flow. And we'll do more accents. And some salt and pepper. Salt. Pepper. Bring it down. And we'll cook it another three minutes. Alexa, set another timer for three minutes. Three minutes. Starting now. Meanwhile, we'll get our roll ready. We're having this on a Kaiser roll. What you want to do is you want to take out some of the excess filling of the roll. Because you don't want all that, that gunk. Just so it's a nice little roll. So that, that gets out some of this filling. By the way, we're also cooking some uh, some fries. So we'll take this and we'll throw that out. Let's take a look at our fries. In the meantime, we're going to take this and we're going to put this in the air fryer and we're going to cook it for just about a minute. It only takes a minute because if you cook it too long, it dries out in the air fryer. And you don't want it to dry out, do you? No, you don't want this to dry out. So let's take a look at this air fryer. Our fries are looking pretty good. So let's put this roll in here, like that. And tap it down. And we'll do it for Alexa, set a timer for a minute. Second timer. One minute. Starting now. Everything's coming done. Everything's coming done. Hey Tom, how's it going? Okay? Okay. Let's see how this is looking. Not quite what we want yet. But you know, you gotta be real careful. Let's take a pause and I'll be back in a minute. Oh, there's the minute. 
Alexa, stop. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put one little slice of cheese on the burger. Cheese on the burger. You know, I don't usually use that much cheese on cheeseburgers, but I don't do cheeseburgers that often. Let's close the lid. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here we go. We can unplug this. Let's go get that roll and let's get our fries. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Boom boom. Time to play the meal. Time to play the meal. Oh. See, look at this roll. Look how long that. That's just like two minutes, three minutes tops in the air fryer. Time to plate the meal. Put the Taylor ham over here. Time to plate the meal. Time to plate the meal. You see, it's it's it's. It's, it's toasted and not ruined. I learned that the hard way, by the way. I tried to toast something uh, a couple of weeks ago. Not without, you see, this is, uh, yeah, that's why I experiment. And it completely burnt my toast in less than five, in five minutes. It burnt, burnt my roll, burnt my roll, destroyed it. Made it inedible, inedible. So let's put the Taylor ham on top of the cheeseburger. We'll seal this roll up like that. So we got the Taylor ham. See, Taylor, Taylor ham on the cheeseburger. We'll get the fries. We'll put them on the plate. Da -da -da ba -ba -bum -bum -ba -bum. Get some salt, of course. Put on the salt, on the fries. Time to play the meal. Of course, we got the. We're gonna have some A and W root beer with this. You know, we were talking about root beer the other day. This is my personal favorite. Here we go. This is a Jersey burger with Taylor ham. Jeez. Notice it's still a little pink inside. This is the uh, probably the best way to make a burger. You don't want to make it well done. I'm not a big fan of well done burgers. But just a little pink. And that does not stink. So, this is a Jersey cheeseburger. Enjoy.